Hi, today we're making peanut butter oat cookies. Uh, you need creamy peanut butter, about a cup, about a cup brown sugar as well, and then oat milk, which I think is, we're gonna need half a cup of, I mean a quarter of a cup of oat milk. So that's about a quarter. And then we're gonna mix it with our sugar and peanut butter mixture. So we can kind of make it into a paste. Right. You wanna make sure that you're using the creamy peanut butter. I think I said that already. So that's three ingredients so far. I think this one will have five because we're gonna be using baking soda as well as oats. Once that is mixed up, we're gonna drop in a teaspoon of baking soda. And then this is about a cup of oatmeal. Sticky. Uh, obviously you can make your grinder oatmeal a little bit more so it's not too, um, not like mine, I didn't really grind them down. These are just regular rolled oats. Um, I suppose you can also use oat flour. Um, I like the chewiness of the oats though. Um, it's just my preference. And I think we're ready to roll these in and put them on a cookie sheet and bake them. So I'll just finish mixing it, incorporating it all the way through. So again, a cup of peanut butter, a cup of brown sugar, one fourth cup of soy milk or oat milk is what I used, which is the vanilla flavor. You could opt to add vanilla flavoring if you like. Uh, a teaspoon of baking soda, and then also a cup of oat. I'm gonna put this in a cookie sheet and we're gonna bake it. So I'm supposed to ball it up like this. And put it on the pan. It's a little disgusting. Two different sizes since it's my first time making it. I want to see which one would be the softest, I guess. I'm just going to stagger them. Anybody has tips on how to make this not stick too much? Please let me know. Maybe I should have rolled powder in my hands or something. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Hope I'm doing this right. <laughs> So far we've made six, nine, twelve. Wow. 
they're just all different sizes. But there you have our 12. I have to put this away first. Um, last but not least, I saw people fork it down. Just a little bit. I don't know that this will leave a mark <laughs> but we'll try because it's rough oatmeal so there you have it so there's six nine twelve wow there's 15 out of that recipe so we're gonna pop this in the oven for oh, 10 to 12 minutes 10 if you want it softer and then 12 to 15 if you like it harder crunchier so I'm gonna try it, try it for 10 first. Now we're just gonna pop this, these bad boys in for 10 minutes. batch of peanut butter oatmeal cookies. Mm. Hi! So, as you know, I just baked my first ever peanut butter oatmeal cookies. To me, they seem pretty crumbly. But... Take a tie. A tie. Let's take a try. It's nice and mushy inside. And then the outside is a little bit. crumbly but I feel like if you break them ever so slightly it will just automatically break into several pieces definitely soft inside and then outside it's a little bit hard maybe if I cooked it a little less it'll all be soft all around I like it so if you have suggestions, um, things I did wrong while I was trying to make this, please let me know. And if you want to try the recipe, please let me know how it goes and how you tweaked it to suit your taste. And maybe I can try that recipe as well. Thanks for watching. I think I just didn't wait for it to set at the beginning. About five and a half. Yeah, let me know if you like this recipe or if you have plans on trying it and if you want to tell me how it works out for you. Please let me know. I hope you enjoy it. Thanks. Bye. Excuse the AC. It's pretty hot today.